guys from THC out on the road, man. It's Oz with In Now Magazine. What's been going on with you guys? Shoot, just uh, working. Got, just working. Got out of the studio right now. We're doing the brand new THC album, so we're bouncing back and forth between that, and hitting out, and getting back out, making some, hitting some shows. Tell us about that a little bit, man. We are working with uh, Sterling Winfield down in Dallas. He, of course, did all the Pantera albums. Producing you know? this one ourselves. Yeah, we'll be uh, producing. It's going to be awesome. All this is going to be. It's going to go back to our roots. Right on, man. Kind of, kind of stepping back a little bit. Yes, the way sir. Used to be. Yes, sir. Man, I, you know, I've been with you guys since the beginning. Of course. Ah. Uh, you guys stayed on the road pretty constant. Uh, you guys playing here? Where are you going next? Uh, we'll actually we'll take four Fort days off Earth. Christmas, and then we head down to Fort Worth to do uh, New Year's Eve. Right on. And then we'll right. go right back in the studio and start finishing up the album. When do you expect that to be done? Uh, looks like uh, it should be done. Summer. By spring. By spring, uh, summer, it should be out. Right on. The goal is spring, you know, be realistic. It might be summer. Yeah. Just, just what album are you guys touring on right now? Uh, right now we're still touring on the Right On album. Right On. That's, uh, I love that album, man. I, you know, I've got all of them. Uh, so what else been going on? This is Timmy and, and Cord and John here. Man, I've known them all for a long time. John's been a good friend of mine for a long time. I have, man. We've met several good. times. And, we were uh, just talking on the way up here before. <laughs> I was like, man, I haven't hit you up for a while, man. Do you remember me? He's like, fuck yeah. Man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so what's going on with your bases and stuff, man? Was, oh, man, uh, I'm still working with uh, Diamond Bases right now. Uh, DBZ Diamond, they're best, some of the best bases in the world, man. So I'm really digging them. Uh, You'll see one tonight. Right on. Out there, I'm with uh, Harky as well, so I got some new equipment. I've got a big wall of paint, as I like to call just it. Got seen him out there. Yeah, just got a base stolen. We yeah. actually had a. We were in the studio when our singer got his truck stolen. Oh shit! And when they stole that, they got my base. So it was one of them deals. You know, it happens. Right on, man. So what's going never on? Never even played it. Never. Yeah, it's played a on. Yeah, but <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> it ain't broke in yet. <laughs> yeah. So uh, what's hold, what's holding the future after first of the year? You guys at any festivals? Uh, we're going to be doing just about every major festival there is. Rock and come out this year. Rock Oklahoma, Rock on the Range. Uh, what is it? Uh, rock. Well, the Carolina on the Rock. Uh, there's some Carolina. Yeah. There's uh, there's uh, Rockville. The one with Rockville. We're going to be the one in Florida. We're going to be all over the place, man. Right. It's going to be a non-stop tour as soon as summer hits. As soon as, as that always. album drops, we're gone. As always, yeah. you guys are road warriors. Y'all just stay on the road constantly. I've settled down a little bit myself and went back to working and. Yeah, we to talk about that. Oh, man, you're having a better time than we are. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that, man. I love being on the road. So, but uh, so, tell me a little bit about this new album and about going back to the roots and just going back to the roots. or going back to what you know brought THC to the forefront to begin with. This, uh, you know, uh, we've got a few songs sound something like it maybe could have gone back as far as Pride of Texas. Right but on. you know, Cord is just churning out some of the killerest riffs that we've got, man. And I can't wait for y'all to hear it. Matter of fact. We'll debut a new song here tonight. Cool. I'm not saying it's going to be good. Some cool. But we're going to try to play. It. It's going to be, <laughs> what part of the set's going to be in? It's going to be about the middle. About the middle. We're going to get a video and put it on the website. You want to wait on it? That's nah, your call, man. All right. We're supposed to do three videos, I think, for this one. Um, but no, I was going to say that's something. I was just talking to a guy right before we got in here, and it's pretty cool. I never really heard it um, kind of put in comparison like this, but. He didn't, I don't think he realized I was in the band. I mean, I think he found out eventually, but um, just talking about like the movement that we have going on, he compared it to Grateful Dead, you know? And I was like, you know, that's, he's like, I haven't seen anything like this since Grateful Dead. And I was like, no one's really ever, you know, our, awesome. our fans and our family and how, you know, I, I told him, I was like, I agree, our fans are like, you know, pretty much the best fans of any. If we as much as the Dead, I've never heard that we'd be happy. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I've never heard of the Grateful Dead comparison. I thought that was pretty. That just happened like five minutes ago. Yeah, but you guys have a huge following. You know, I've kept, I've always kept up with you guys. Like I said, I've known John forever and Rich and. There's just fan clubs all over the place. And, you know, man, it doesn't matter where they're not so much everywhere. Everybody calls them fans to us. They're family, as you well know, man. I mean, I we're family. Yeah. You know what I mean? The day we have Thanksgiving we, we, last year. How we had Thanksgiving with uh, our fans. We were on the road yeah. and we met up in Joplin. We all, you know, had Thanksgiving. Yeah, oh, that's the cool. Lobby, we got so you know? yeah. yeah. I know every band says this, but we got the absolute coolest fans in the world, man. They will come I around agree. with spreads and hang out. I mean, you've been there. Yeah, I have, man. I've been down in the hall and everywhere else. So it's I'm, awesome. I mean, our hats off to them, man. So I've been asking everybody this because it's bothered me a little bit. I've heard a lot of people say that rock is dead. What do you think about when you hear the comment rock is dead? Bullshit. Just if I can say that. Excuse me. Burr crap. Yeah, yeah, you can say whatever you want to. That's private. Oh, what do you think? Uh, what do you think? I mean, it, it's struggling, but it's not dead. It can still, you know. I kind of see it in pockets. You know, it's, yeah. it's yeah, not sure, on the sure. forefront. With the, I don't want to say what other 
bullshit. <laughs> but it's not on the forefront right now, but, but there's so many good pockets. Just because so rock changes doesn't mean Man, you know, dead. rocks have always been underground, so you can never get rid of it, you can never squash it out. And it's, you watch, it's making a, it's, it's that, that turn in music is coming again. Right. You know what I mean? Every so often right. it'll go like this, and it'll sit there and be like, oh, and then it'll turn back. Yeah. It's starting to happen again, yeah. so you're starting to see all these bands that they're not what you would normally say, you know, would be this. You can't categorize them. I call them rock. Cause that's what it right, is. Exactly. This is when you get out so there and you're doing this and you're looking on everybody, that's rock and roll. It is, man. That's no exactly matter what. what. Right? Yeah. If you're rocking out, it's rock. That's you know, right. It's got electric guitars, drums, bass, and vocals. That's pretty much that's rock. Right, I mean, yeah. It is, man. You guys have always had a great, you know, red dirt metal sound. And I know, I've always thought you guys were kind of the pioneers to help get that going, you know. As we feel grateful, man. You know, it's just, I think, you know, that all, we just, picked up where other bands have left off, you know what I mean? And tried to put our own twist on it. That's that's what that is. Yeah. Have you seen the have you seen the Sons of Texas? You know, oh yeah, guys? love those guys. Yeah. Holy man. shit, man. They, they not just kick ass. ass. I was like, wow man, it reminds me of some other shit that I know. You know? Yeah. <laughs> those guys kill it, man. Big, yeah. big fans. Big yeah, fans. they were here just a few weeks ago and I, I think they should have been a little higher on the bills than what they were, but Oh uh, watch next time they come around they'll be headlining. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. they're 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 taking names and kicking ass and that's awesome. So you have this new album coming out in hopefully springtime. Yes, sir. You're touring on that nonstop. You got any plans for Europe? Go to Europe? Uh, we're in the talks with it. You know, right now there's nothing in, in definite that I can really say anything about. But we're always wanting to go. We we love our fans over there. You know, especially like get over there to Brazil and all that again. stuff. I know we are going back to Canada here in about. Uh, it's part of the festival. I think we're going to be on is in Canada. So right we'll on. be seeing. We'll be around everywhere. When summertime hits, you're going to see us everywhere. Do the Canada fans different? From here, man, they're the awesome. Band, the, they're awesome. Yeah, they're yeah. crazy. They're we, crazy. Yeah, crazy. We went back a year after Mayhem, and I mean, it was crazy. Pretty much sold out. Yeah. So we went, did a handful of dates over, and everywhere we went, I mean, people were like, man, I saw you Mayhem, and then they came to every show. And for that, that's like traveling right. from Chicago. We had to people Texas. fly from Ireland yeah. to that show. Yeah. 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 Right on. I just everywhere I, tonight. I mean, you guys haven't been to Wichita for a little while. I've seen yeah. so many people tonight that I haven't got to see in a long time. Just hanging out. We're glad to be here. We love playing here, man. man love there's a great crowd. There is. Is that not awesome? Yeah. yeah. Jackson Taylor out there fixing to the kill it. Yeah. Too. You know, I, a little different mix for you guys. Yeah. Had him, but I've known Jackson for a long time too, and he's a, he's a great guy. And he he is. Makes some good music, man. Yes, sir. Uh, let's see. Yeah. I, I don't know if I got much more for you guys. I'm glad you guys got a new album coming out. Man, thank you. It'll be called Dark Side of Black. Everybody right start on. Playing, you know, be looking for it. It'll be hitting. You gonna release some tracks early on that one, or? Man, I don't know if we'll be doing that. That'll be up to the label. So we're just right now. We're just gonna get the music done, hand it to them, and step back and see what they got for us. Right on. <laughs> well, I appreciate you guys, you guys taking the time to talk with me, dude. Thanks, man. I love you, guys, man. Yeah, Merry man. Christmas, brother. Oh yeah. Good <laughs> to see you guys. Yes, sir. Right now, so, uh, right now. yeah. And man, I hope you guys have a great show. I'll be right up front taking some great pictures of you guys. Right on. You'll see them on, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll send them to you. Hell yeah, soon as you get done, come on back, man. We'll have a beer and Right on, man. You guys, uh, 